I'm in the key of G, one sharp. So let's put a C right here. This C takes the place of putting a 4-4 four, four there. So I can either put a, a C here, which you now know is in 4-4, four, 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 or I can just erase that and simply go like this, 4-4. Four, four. And they're both the same. The C means common time, 4-4. Four, four. The 4-4 four, four means common time, okay? And uh, if I were to also write here, a C with a line through it, that's my cut time. So you're probably saying to yourself, okay, Walt, I get it now. I'm starting to get it. Uh, yes, the merch is live. Go to waltrebear.net slash store. It's all, it's all right there. Plus, it's going to be updated a lot in the next week or two. But at least it's up. At least it's live. At least it's going. So, uh, you know, definitely, yes. waltrebear.net slash store. Um, okay, so now you're probably saying to yourself, okay, I know that cut time is 2-2. Two, two. I know that common time is 4-4. Four, four. So when would I ever write something in 2-2 two, two instead of 4-4? Four, four? Well, that's a great question. The thing is that when you're in cut time, it's sometimes referred to as, um, as a breakdown, okay? So let's write that down. A breakdown. A breakdown in music is that if I'm going 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1... Two, three, ba, 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 four, ba, 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 one, two, three, four. That right there was going from normal four, four to a breakdown in two, two. Listen to it. It goes one, two, three. Listen to the drums. Listen to the drums, okay? Drums. One, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. Ready? Right here. Okay, everybody hear that? So watch, I'm going to bop my head to it again. I'm going to bop my head to it. And then you're going to hear the breakdown. And then my head is going to stay on this tempo. But now the drums are going to hit on every other beat. The beat doesn't change. The beat remains the same. It's the same tempo. Okay, so now, now you know. So we're right here, the breakdown 2-2 two, two, and the 4-4-4. Four, four, four. So ultimately, if a time signature is in 2-2, two, two, cut time, it's telling you that the half note gets the beat. If it's in 4-4, four, four, it's telling you that the chord note gets the beat. So the drummer before is going 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. And now, keeping the same beat, it's going to do this right here. It's going to go 1, 2, 3, 4. One, two, three, four, instead of one, two, three, four. So I'm trying to think of a good example of a breakdown so that you guys can listen to it. If there's a piece of music that, uh, I, I, you, you know what? Heavy metal does breakdowns a lot. Jazz a lot of times plays stuff in cut time. A lot, a lot of times. Uh, I'm trying to think. Beethoven's Fifth, fifth Symphony, the, the, uh, da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Okay, I'm horrible. I shouldn't. I shouldn't have went at that octave. I should have went lower. Um, Takata fugue. No, it's not the Takata fugue. Um, da, 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 da. Yes. Um, so that's an example of something being in cut time.